and the masters of the universe. I am Adam, Prince of Eternia and defender of the secrets of Castle Grayskull. This is Cringer, my fearless friend. Fabulous secret powers were revealed to me the day I held aloft my magic sword and said, By the power of Grayskull! became the mighty battle cat and I became He-Man, the most powerful man in the universe. Only three others share this secret. Our friends, the Sorceress, Man-at-Arms, and Orko. Together we defend Castle Grayskull from the evil forces of Skeletor. warriors in the universe. Somewhere on this planet I will find the perfect gladiator for my cosmic games. But who will it be? A warrior known as Ram Man, perhaps. No. No, he possesses great strength. The oaf is too clumsy for my purposes. Man's power is mighty indeed. But his savage nature makes him completely untamable. No, oh, for my games, I'll need the greatest fighter the universe has ever known. None other than He-Man himself. And now to fake a distress call that will lead the hero to me. Cat, that distress call said there was a spacecraft down near here. It's he, man. I knew he'd answer the call for help. You know what to do. As you wish, Game Master. <laughs> Strange, there's no sign of a spacecraft or anything else out here. I don't like this. It feels like a trap. He looks like Skeletor's got himself a brand new gang of flunkies. I'm not so sure they're from Skeletor. Right, E Man. Who are you? I am the Game Master. I travel the universe, collecting the mightiest warriors for my cosmic games. So, you faked that distress call. I did. I had to lure you out to test your power for myself. I was most impressed. You'll make a fine addition to my arena. Sorry, not interested. Your interests do not concern me, He-Man. You will serve me as I wish. Since you like games so much, try playing with this. You've made your point, warrior. Come, there's nothing for us here. You're going to let him go? Of course not, fool. He's got to have some hidden weakness I can use against him, and my little spy here will find out what it is.
it to my father. His new training robot is good. Maybe too good. Allow me. Sometimes a shield works best as a weapon. I'll remember that. Thanks, He-Man. What happened with that distress call you went to investigate? Was anyone in danger? Only me, Tila. Some villain calling himself the Game Master tried to take me as a gladiator for his cosmic games. What happened? Well, Battle Cat and I turned down his offer. Thank goodness. I hate it if you were taken away from Eternia. I'd be losing one of the best warriors I ever knew, as well as one of my best friends. You mean a lot to me. You mean a great deal to me, too. job for you. My little spy has told me that He-Man is fond of a certain young woman in the Eternian Royal Guard. If we were to capture her, He-Man would surely offer himself to us for her release. Now come, we have much to plan. There it is, ladies. Man-at-Arms latest invention, the Android Horse. Show us how it works, Adam. We'd love to see. All you have to do is sit in the saddle and say, Forward, Strider. Go! Nay! Get the ball! Get the ball! Allow me. Strider, stop and obey. We changed Strider's vocal command unit today. Anyone who tries to ride it besides Man-at-Arms or me gets thrown. I wish I'd known that before I took my bath. I wish you'd realize you don't have to show off to impress people. There's a real charmer inside you, Adam. And I like that fellow a lot. More than he, man? I like you both, but for different reasons. You could never be a warrior like He-Man is. Oh, I don't know. I, I'm pretty good with a sword. <laughs> Adam. <laughs> Adam, I'll need that sword. But wait, Tila. <laughs> You didn't think you could hold us off with a single sword, did you, boy? My sword! I think I'll keep this as a memento of my easy victory. Take this message to He-Man, boy. If he ever wants to see Teela again, he must surrender himself to me at my cosmic arena. Tell him to come alone, or Teela will remain my prisoner forever. Adam, those aliens, where are they taking Teela? They're holding her as bait for He-Man. Well, why don't you just become He-Man and go after them? I wish I could, Orko, but... Well, they took my sword. Oh, no! I'm going after them. Tila said I'd never be the hero He-Man is. Well, I hope for her sake she's wrong. I have a reading on the Game Master's ship. It's just south of the Mystic Mountains. Are you sure we have to go through with this? Well, as long as He-Man can't make it, we're the only hope Tila has. But the Game Master said He-Man was to come alone. If he sees you... He won't see me. I've got a plan, which is where you two come in. A 
nice try, woman. But I win, as always. Perhaps I was wrong to insist on He-Man as my champion. You have considerable skills of your own. Unlock this door and I'll show you some skills you won't forget. In good time, my dear. He-Man comes to rescue you. I'll have Eternia's two mightiest warriors to fight for my amusement forever. <laughs> Now you know what to do. Sure, just leave everything to me. That's it. We're doomed for sure. Who seeks an audience with the Game Master? I am Orko the Great, Eternia's mightiest hunter. I have come to offer this mighty jungle cat to the Game Master for his cosmic circus. Doesn't look like much of a fighter, but we'll let the master decide. So you want to bargain for this creature, do you? Uh, let's see what he does. You see before you one of the fiercest, most savage creatures from this or any other planet. Where? Where? And you remember? Oh, yeah, right. <coughs> roar! Growl! Roar! Is that it? Oh, no. Oh, when you see him in action, first we'll need a volunteer. <coughs> Afraid of him, are you? Uh, afraid of him? No. Uh, uh, afraid of his teeth and claws? <laughs> yes. Ah, I've wasted enough time with this. That cat is no fighter. This calls for drastic measures. <sighs> Take him. I could always use him as a clown or something. That looks like the prisoner area up ahead. Tila! Tila! <laughs> I see you chose not to deliver my message to He-Man. That will be a mistake you'll regret, since you and your friends went to so much trouble to sneak in. It would be a shame for you to miss the games. <laughs> Take him away! Now what's gonna happen? I don't think you're gonna like the answer. I know you came hoping to rescue your friend Tila, so I have thoughtfully released her to watch you fight. Adam! Adam is no warrior. He'll never survive your terrible games. He should have thought of that before coming here. Let the games begin. My sword. If I could just get it. Your opponent is Kragox the Terrible. You can see how he earned that name. <laughs> But once Kragox uses his stinger, it will all be over. Adam, look out for its tail! 
If only I could get my hands free. Come on, magic. I've seen in ages. You big bully! You hurt Gila! I'll get you from this, you floating death! Leave him to me, Orko. By the power of Grey Skull! for your friends at last. That's right. And once they're safe, I'll settle with you. <laughs> nice going, cat. You've defeated my best warrior, He-Man. But you won't be so lucky with me. Game Master, let's finish this man-to-man. -man. My trident! I said man-to-man, -man, Game Master. Or do you cheat at every game you play? My disc tractor will take care of you. You're not playing fair. I still have my servants, the most powerful warriors gathered from around the universe. Yes, warriors you trapped by force and used as slaves in your games. How loyal are they now? Come back and fight, you cowards! Game's over. You lose. No, I always win. It's not fair. If there's one thing I can't stand, it's a sore loser. How are you feeling? I'm fine. But Adam... He's safe. In fact, I couldn't have rescued you without his help. I know. I never thought I'd see Adam play the hero. Neither did I. Now that the Game Master's in the palace jail, you are all free to go home. My time corridor will send you back. I still can't believe it. But this time, I guess we owe it all to Adam. Just between us, Tila, what kind of a man would you prefer? Someone like Adam or someone like me? I don't know. I guess I'm looking for a, a man with Adam's wit and your courage. <laughs> but where would I find him? Today, He-Man 
was forced to play a dangerous game by the Game Master. The Game Master bragged a lot about winning all the time, but he became angry when he lost and said it wasn't fair. Well, playing games can be a lot of fun, but boasting when you win or getting angry when you lose spoils the fun for everyone. And pretty soon, nobody will want to play with you. So take a tip from me. Be a good winner and a good loser. You'll enjoy your games more, and so will the people who play with you. Good luck and goodbye!